When you look at your desktop, it might seem like Windows has just tossed things around randomly. Programs cover each other or dangle off the desktop. But there's a way to make neat piles and put your favorite windows on top of the stack. Let's say you see a little bit of the window you're after. Just move the mouse and hover over it, then click, and the window is active. You can also click the program's icon on the taskbar to bring that window to the front. Or hold down the Alt key and keep tapping the Tab key. You'll see the thumbnails of every open window. When you get to the one you want, let go of the Alt key and the window pops up to the front. You can also use the Windows key to do the same thing. Hold down the Windows key and press Tab to see a 3D view of your open windows. Keep tapping the Tab key until the window you want comes to the front and then let go of the Windows key. To move windows around, you can drag the window using its title bar and then just drop it where you want it. It'll stay on top of the pile. Let's say you just want to see one window and you want it to fill the screen. Double-click the title bar along the window's top and see how big the window gets. To shrink it, just double-click again and you can see everything it covered up. You can also use this button to do the exact same thing. Windows 7 also lets you maximize a window in a new way. Drag the top edge of the window until it butts up against the top of the desktop. Let go of the mouse and the window fills the screen. To close any window, just click the red X. If you want to resize a window, you can click and drag the edges like this. Point at any corner, and when the arrow turns to a two-headed arrow, just drag it to the size you want and let go or drop it. If you want to see two windows side by side, there's a quick way to do that. Right click on a blank part of the taskbar and choose Show Windows Side by Side. If you have more than two windows open, just minimize the ones you don't want. Another way to do that is drag one window against one side of the monitor. And when the shaded edges fill that side, let go. Now do the same thing with the other window on the other side. So arrange your windows in a neat pile, or let Windows 7 scatter them on your desktop. It's your choice.